Yeah, that's the sauce. No, it is? Yeah. Okay, good. That's good. All right. I'm sorry, I'm so hungry. My mouth is just watering. Hey, Pom Pom Gang, welcome back to the Pom Pom Sisters YouTube channel. My name is Shantae, and today I'm with my lovely husband. Yeah, I'm Christian. And uh, welcome back to our channel. If you are new, hey, how you doing? Hope you are doing well and being safe with, all, with everything going on right now. Please uh, feel free to subscribe. In uh, today's video, we will be, uh, we're doing an anniversary edition. Mm -hmm. We're doing an anniversary uh, video. Our anniversary is May 17th. And unfortunately, we weren't able to make our plans that- no, Not really. Yeah, yeah. everything was uh, shut down and closed. So we decided to just have a small little dinner here at home and we picked up our favorite Thai food. Thai fried rice from our favorite Thai restaurant called Tu Rim Kong, located here in Fayetteville. <laughs> huh? uh, we picked up some uh, fried rice, shrimp fried rice, which is medium, some uh, spring rolls, of course. You cannot have uh, Thai food without some spring rolls. And uh, we also picked up some uh, fried chicken wings and we got some uh, sauce to dip it in, which I absolutely love that freaking sauce. In this video, we're kind of just gonna tell you guys, we're gonna have a story and a dinner, I guess you can say. We're gonna have dinner and a story. There we go, dinner and a show. That's what it is, dinner and a show. We are going to uh, tell you guys how we first met, how we became the pompons. So we got shrimp fried rice. What was spicy? Yeah, they usually don't disappoint on the spice. Yeah. So that other favorite one. We're not gonna shout them out because there's no free shout outs. <laughs> um, but they started disappointing. Very. Like yeah. they fell off something terrible. So I came across these barefoot spritzers that oh my gosh, I freaking love. I had the peach and honey flavor. It's like summertime in a can, like I love it. So how we first met was 11 years ago. So we have been together for 11 years. We are celebrating our eighth, our eighth anniversary, wow. which is the year of pottery. It's the year of pottery. So our plans for this year that ended up getting canceled, we wanted to uh, have like a relaxing uh, just day to ourselves we were just enjoy one another and relax because our last couple of trips we weren't able to really relax no we walk around everywhere that flies gonna piss me the hell off i'm going to kill the fucking fly um <clears throat> our plans this year was to um Take a spa day, do a couple's uh, spa. Mm, couple's have, retreat. Yeah, have a nice uh, steak dinner, very expensive <laughs> steak dinner. And we were gonna take a pottery class where we could like paint our own pottery and that was just gonna be our anniversary with one another. Just Yeah, that all got canceled. So now we are just going to enjoy some wonderful Thai food and some good company. Mommy, <laughs> it's mommy. Hey lady. Leave the camera, we're recording. Oh, we're eating? Yeah. Plates <laughs> <laughs> with these big lemons. Don't be hating on my plates yeah, of lemons. Yeah, I would just fuck yeah, I would Look, Lisa's <laughs> better than a pal of mail. You're interrupting a video woman. Well, you should have said, you knew I was coming over. I you knew you were coming over. I didn't know you were coming over. And did your video, because I'm going to talk. Well, I'm going to need you to not talk while we're recording. <laughs> Y'all eat it? Yes. Uh, Why? Because that's what people like to watch. Don't. Yes, they do. <laughs> I don't want to see nobody eating. You don't want to see nobody eating. Mm -mm. But everybody else did. Pay her no attention, guys. <laughs> no, idiot. She's okay. just in the background eating her Zaxby's. I'm not understanding what people getting out of here. Have a conversation. Mm -mm. They're trying to get to know us if you fly it. <laughs> well, we actually agree with it. We actually just put your phone on top. <laughs> we met 11 years ago through my oldest brother. See the commentary back there. Uh, you know what? I'm regretting inviting her to my house now. 11 years ago through my oldest brother. <laughs> 
I had guilt tripped him and making him feel bad because he didn't hang out with me, which he didn't. He didn't hang out with me a lot. So he ended up getting invited to his boss's wedding. My brother called me and decided to invite me to go with him as his plus one to his wedding because he didn't have no one else to go with, I guess. So I agreed to go to the wedding because, I mean, he said he was gonna buy me a new dress. And how can he turn down a new dress? Especially me, because I'm girly. And she's still back there talking. And we go shopping at um, Macy's. He took us to Macy's so he could buy me a new dress. Mm -hmm. So he didn't know what to wear. Mm -hmm. And he decides to call Christian for fashion advice. Christian tells him. I just told him what I was wearing. And what were you wearing, man? Yeah, what were you wearing? <laughs> Some really cool SB Dunks. What color were these? They were green. No white check. And had some red thrown in there. Sounds like a very colorful outfit. Very mm -hmm. colorful very. outfit. I didn't know what to wear at the wedding. My uh my boss's wedding, first wedding I've ever been to. So I asked I asked her what what do I need to wear at the wedding? I, I don't know what kind of clothes to wear. She said, I don't know, just stand out. And that was the wrong thing to say. And green and black <laughs> and purple is what you <laughs> So when Gerard calls Christian to ask for his advice on what to wear, Christian tells him, well, man, I'm wearing, you know, a red shirt. A red shirt, green tie. You should wear a green shirt <laughs> with a red tie. I said, hell no. <laughs> I am not walking into no way. <laughs> With you wear some damn Christmas colors. And then the wedding was in the middle of June. It was in July. summer. No, in the middle of June. So it's hot as hell in the middle of the summer, walking around with some Christmas colors on like a whole damn fool. He had the nerve to take a selfie because he thought he just looked so fine. I did look good. Yeah, I looked good too. Yeah, I, I, was, standing, I was standing out. I was definitely he definitely out. stood out. I will give you that, baby. Yeah, yeah. So I told you all we would wear the green shirt, mm -hmm. but, not, but the red not the red tie. So instead, he picked out a black tie, and I wore a green dress as well. We missed the ceremony, but we were going to make it to the reception. He wanted to meet up with Christian so we could all meet up at the reception together. Mm -hmm. So we pull up into the Walmart parking lot, mm -hmm. and me and Gerard are sitting in the car waiting for Christian to pull up, and all I hear... It's Trey songs bumping through some 808 stereos <laughs> and up pulls Christian. And we get in the car and, you know, Christian trying to be all nice and savvy and, and think he cute. And he sees me and he's just like, oh, man, I didn't know Gerard had a sister. What's your name? <laughs> Not talk like that. <laughs> He looked a hot ass mess. Mm -hmm. He was cute. I'm like, I'm Christian, just you're married to you with three kids. <laughs> yes, Christian's over there trying to talk to me, talking, you know, hi, how are you? And I'm just giving him the stank, bougie ass, mm -hmm, yeah, whatever. End up leaving the wedding and getting in, back into Christian's Crown Vic. And he's drunk, and there's like five other adults in the car. For some reason, they decided to let Christian drive. So yeah, everybody in the car was capable. We don't know what we were thinking. They weren't thinking, just like I wasn't. I'm gonna say, Christian, I don't think this is a good idea. And he starts recapping of his wonderful night, and he ends up crying when he starts talking about the daddy daughter dance and how. So beautiful. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> and at that moment, I just knew he was going to be the father of my children. She said, oh, the kid is so sensitive. He is so sensitive. Like, I like that shirt he has. Bro. I did not like that shirt he had. I think that was the highlight of the Christmas. That yeah, was yeah. not the that highlight. It definitely was. He's sensitive, and I like his outfit. A <laughs> couple weeks go by. And this is when MySpace was still kind of popular. And he hits me up like, hey, I didn't know we were MySpace friends. You know, you remember me? And he gives me his number. And I reply back. <laughs> she said, I didn't ask for your number. <laughs> That's how I read it, too. He, I was trying to be a smart ass, really. And he just left it at that. He was just like, oh, okay. And didn't even, mm -hmm. like, try to argue with me or nothing. He was just, all right, fine then. And then a couple more weeks go by. That's how I got her. I didn't reply back. <laughs> I'm just gonna let her remember being that shirt. <laughs> we went out on our first date. 
We went to go see a paranormal activity. Paranormal. We went to go see paranormal oh, activity. That movie. And I hate scary movies. I don't even know why I agreed to go see it. My brother didn't even want me dating him because you know, Geico. You're not supposed to date the little sister. I brought a third wheel with me, my best friend at the time, because I didn't know him. I didn't know if he was gonna like try to kidnap me and. In that shirt? <laughs> <laughs> that was the beginning of our now 11 year relationship. And it all started from that shirt and tie. From that shirt and tie. From that ugly and ass. SB dunks and then glasses. <laughs> Together for now 11 years. We've been married for, we are celebrating our eighth year, eight years of marriage. What does outfit look like again? I'm gonna we now that. have three <laughs> <laughs> beautiful children. I might still have it. No, I threw it out. Oh, Lord, why don't you throw out the legendary outfit? Mm -hmm. I threw it out. Thank you, Pom Pom Game, for joining us and having my wonderful mother in the background to entertain y'all as well. Guys, thank you for joining us. Um, our dinner was very delicious. Thank you to uh, Two Rim Kong, located here in Fayetteville. Great Thai restaurant. Very good. Let us know in the comments below what restaurant that you would like for us to try next so we can do more videos of dinner and a story. Next time, we'll probably leave the crazy lady in the background out of it. I won't be here. <laughs> but now y'all know the story of how I met my corny husband. And uh, this is why I am just so crazy in love with this corny ass man. This so. is a shirt. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And hit the little bell icon and you'll be updated on every video that you post. Yeah, we post every or weekly at least twice a week we're gonna go ahead and end this i'm gonna finish off the rest of my fried rice and kick my mom out the house thank you guys for joining us bye